What is up, guys? It's me, MW Reboy, bringing you some more Call of Duty gameplay on Saturday. Yep, that's right, Saturday. So it's the Real Call Experience, Episode Five, I believe. And yes, I'm more enthusiastic than I was last week because I was tired from staying up late all the time. Anyway, guys, let's talk about the gameplay before we actually get into the real discussion. All right. Gameplay is search and destroy. Right? On lockdown. I went 12 and 4 on this, and I really. Well, no. Let's start with this. I had this uh, gameplay for a little bit now. Maybe a month or so. So, yeah, it's been a long awaited video. No, no. Yeah, yeah, it's been a month. Maybe a month and a half. But, yeah, it's been a long awaited video anyway. But yeah, my friend Missy Six Freddy was playing in this too. But you won't be seeing much of him in this. Uh, but what else can I tell you about the gameplay? Well, for people who don't know what Search and Destroy is, Search and Destroy is sort of where you have to either destroy or defend the bomb site A or B. And then you only have one life. And you don't respond after that, you just spectate. Which you'll see a few examples of when I die. But yeah, pretty much that's all to it. Now, I want to make this quick. Okay, let's talk about the top five things I hate about Call of Duty. Yeah, that's the thing I want to talk about. The top five things I hate about Call of Duty. Now, Call of Duty is known for lots of things. Campers, overpowered weapons, leg... And especially, especially aggressive players, alright? Now, let's start with my least favorite. Number five, the Strikers. Yep, yeah, Strikers. I hate Striker noobs, alright? I can't even play a game without seeing a Striker noob. I mean, every other shotgun I don't mind, but when I see a Striker, it's like... Yeah. I just want to go back to what I thought of MW2. I mean, the striker wasn't as overpowered as it is in MW3, so... They really messed up the game when they did that, you know? And number four, I would say, is campers. Yes, number four is campers. I hate campers. When I first started playing uh, Call of Duty, I didn't know what a camper was. Well, not first playing Call of Duty. World at War, actually. When I started playing World at War, I didn't know what a camper was until it was explained to me. And so, yeah, I was... You know, I don't like campers. I, I don't like campers much anymore. I mean, I used to be a camper. But things change, people change. I stopped being a camper. I started, like, rushing and using tactics, which you should. But yeah, I that's the fourth thing I hate is campers. Um, number three would probably be heartbeat sensors, which kind of falls into the campers category. Because campers use heartbeat sensors to tell where someone's coming from. I mean, I know it's well it's still good to use a heartbeat sensor when you're running around and actually playing the game properly. But when you're a noob well, yeah, noob camper, no. Don't even play with me if you're going to be camping and using a heartbeat sensor. I'm not trying to disrespect anyone, but still. I just don't want you guys playing with me if you're going to camp with a heartbeat sensor. But yeah, it kind of falls into the campus category, so yeah. But still, it counts. It counts, okay? Uh, Yeah, this is number two, I think, now. Yep, number two. God, number two is the leg. Or... Yeah, the leg. Call of Duty is known for leg. I mean, come on. Every time I've played MW3 or MW2, there's always some major leg. I mean, when I've played Black Ops, there was no leg. But then again, that's a different company, and they have a better understanding of what people want. Infinity Awards, though, does not get the concept, we don't want leg. You give us leg, then we're not gonna actually play. I mean, I know lots of people switch over to Battlefield because of that. 
because Battlefield barely has any lag on their servers. And if anyone else just got that rent a server update, please tell me you hate it like me. But yeah, that's the second thing I hate is lag. And the most want well the most thing the most uh, I need to think of a word. The thing I hate most of Call of Duty is their aggressive players. Now, when you play Battlefield or like some other game like Halo, do you get those aggressive players? And sure, but you don't get the ones like you do on Call of Duty where they're like, Oh, I'm gonna kill you, I'm gonna find out where you live, and blah blah blah. You know, I did your mom last night, huh? No. You don't get those kind of players. Like, come on, man. It's just the game. I get mad sometimes at the game, too. But I just... I don't go into a public match and say it. I don't be racist about anything, you know? Like, come on, guys. I don't swear about it. I don't say I'm gonna, you know, break my disc or my system because of this. No, I just, you know, express how I feel to my friends or something. And then, yeah, just get it out of my system. And then just remember, oh, I'm playing this for fun. And, you know, fun is fun. You don't get mad about it. But, yeah, come on, guys. Don't get mad about this. Don't get mad about Call of Duty screwing you over or something. Like, I can understand getting mad about leg, But getting mad about someone using a gun they like, which kind of falls back to the striker. But, yeah. Kind of backfire. It kind of backfires on me somewhat. But yeah, if someone likes something, then they should use it. I mean, even though other people don't like it, like me for like instance, I don't like the striker or heartbeat sensor. But yeah, if someone likes it, use it. Don't care what other people think. This is only my opinion, guys. I'm not gonna judge you. Yeah. But yeah, those are the top five, five things I hate, and that went by pretty quick. But of course, I wanted to actually discuss other matters too before the end of this video. Because, you know, we got a time frame of 9 minutes. But the other thing I'm going to be talking about... There's two other things I want to talk about. Uh, the thing I wa really want to talk about though is something new I'm doing for the channel. I'm going to be posting a new link on the channel for a site I'm building, an HTML site with scripting and everything. Like, I've never really done something this major before, but I learned a few years back about it, and I thought, hey, this could actually be good, and it would be good to actually show what more things I do, like designing and all that. But yeah, I'm going to be doing a script from scratch with Notepad and all that. It's going to be more of a blog to keep you guys up to date on the videos. So, yes, that site, I don't know how long it's going to take. But all I know is I'll keep you guys up to date on each video Saturday. I'm not even going to bug you about it on Sunday because Sunday, everyone's depressed. And it's like, oh, God, I want to hear this kid talk about him building a site. But, yeah, I'm going to talk to you guys about that on Saturday, every Saturday until it's done. And I'm probably just going to be working on it during school hours. So, yeah. And then the final thing is I'm going to be posting another video of some computer gameplay of Fallout Tactics, maybe, or Men of War Assault Squad. One of those games. Like, I really like those games, and I've been meaning to post some gameplay. But, yeah, I just want you guys to, you know, keep up to date on that. And then, no, yeah, just keep up to date on that. Yeah. I don't think there's much to say anymore, besides, I'm really excited we got more subscribers. We got, well, we have Uniting For Us, which was our first subscriber, and thanks guys, you kind of helped us along with the channel, and yeah, and then we have WestJet's Level 101, a good friend of mine from school actually, and then uh, we have, I'm sorry, I, I'm still trying to learn that the two subscribers' names. But I know one is with Machinima. But thanks, man, for, you know, doing what you did. And, yeah. Anyway, guys, please comment, like, and subscribe. I will be posting another video tomorrow. Well, tonight, too. But, yeah, please comment, like, and subscribe. All right, guys, you are awesome. Look at the final score. Thank you, guys. Have a good night.